Take our lead, let's help you make your mark. Our goal is your satisfaction, let us show you the way. The best examples are the widgets or badges provided by well-established services such as Twitter, Flickr, YouTube, and others. The widget just helps people track their commitment and shows progress being made. Successfully using widgets to realize outcomes is a matter of experimentation and learning. Take our lead. A web widget is a web page or web application that is embedded as an element of a host web page but which is substantially independent of the host page, having limited or no interaction with the host. Some web widgets though serve as user-selectable customizations of the host page itself, my Yahoo. Make your mark, take our lead. Create an embed widget. Open the More Options menu by clicking the ellipsis, or by right-clicking the file. Select Embed Widget. You will be presented with a window which includes HTML iframe code for your new widget, as well as options to adjust the size and default view type of your widget. Make your mark, take our lead. Widgets and apps are separate types of programs that run on an Android phone and they serve different purposes. Widgets are basically self-contained mini-programs that live and run on the phone's home screen. Apps, on the other hand, are typically programs you tap open and run. Make your mark, take our lead. First, touch and hold an open space on your home screen. You'll see an option at the bottom of the screen to view the widget's drawer, which is where they dwell until summoned for duty. Select the widget's drawer, and then browse through the smorgasbord of choices. Take our lead. In Android, the word widget is a generic term for a bit of self-contained code that displays a program, or a piece of a program, that is also, usually, a shortcut to a larger application. Both types are very useful, and it's pretty common to see a widget or two on the home screen of any Android phone. Thank you for watching, please subscribe and hit the bell notification.